All right, I think behind these glass walls with all these pictures on it is uh, the actual bottling factory part. So that's where we're gonna go now. Yep, bottle works. This is a sanitizer. This is the water treatment. It's clean with a multi barrier treatment system. This is the filler capper. Before the bottles can be filled, the inside of it must be pressurized. It allows the force of gravity to draw the beverage into the bottle. A process that ensures a smooth flow of liquid with little to no foaming. I need one of those at home for my glasses so it doesn't foam, but we don't drink it anyway, so uh, anymore. So all the pieces of parts. Elevator, lowerator, whatever that means. Empty bottle inspector takes a picture of every bottle to examine its interior for defects. Uh -huh. exciting part of the trip yes, so far? Yes, it is. Alright, let's go taste it. One of those cool bottles again. 60 plus beverages from around the world. <laughs> Africa, Asia, Europe, Latin America, and North America. That's from Africa? Rob's gonna be the first guinea pig. I'm gonna have to go slow with it because it's gonna add up to a bunch of points if I'm not careful. <laughs> Fanta Exotica. What is it? Fanta Exotica. From Uganda. They have one from Tanzania, Mozambique. That's good. Um, Djibouti, Zimbabwe, South Africa, Mauritius. Mauritius? I don't know how to say that one in South Africa. Kiwi mango. This is a kiwi mango. Candy pine nut, whatever that means. Is it good? That's really good. Which one? That was the uh, kiwi mango. Kiwi mango. This is candy pine nut. 
That's good. Is it? Let me try it. Oh, that's good. It's like a pineapple. It's a crust ginger ale. This is my taste, so I don't overdo it. <laughs> Well, that one wasn't so good. It wasn't sweet at all. This is from Europe. It's called Beverly from Italy. This is good. That is really good. Yeah, that is really good. Which one? This one? Very good. Beverly from Italy is good. That's really good. Medicine. Yeah, it tastes just like medicine. It's bitter. They have one called uh, Kinley Bitter Lemon from England. I'll try it. It's awful. That's what I heard. <laughs> it tastes like medicine. It's my favorite. Your favorite? <laughs> oh, <laughs> man. That's the worst ever. Told yeah. you it was awful. I have to try this one from Estonia. This <laughs> one. Purpley color. It's not very good either. It's pretty good. It's kind of like a uh, raspberry iced tea. It's good. Is it good? From Spain. The Phantom Magic from Estonia is almost like a flavor, slightly flavored mineral water instead of a soda. Okay, we're trying pineapple from Greece. Is it good? Oh, yeah. I'm gonna try this peach from France. Whoopsie, after I spill it all over the house. Thank you. Oh, snap. Yeah, it's good. <laughs> when <do> you... <laughs> it's peach tea. I love peach everything. Oh my gosh, it's not tea. It doesn't taste like tea. That's tea. That is delicious. It's like this light, crisp, refreshing peach flavor. Go around this side. Oh, it's the same ones. Very good difference. North America. It's just a little bit more. <laughs> so I'm gonna have to tell Rob. Just a little bit, Robert. Well, these are all the ones we've tasted. Oh, these are all from the United States, pretty much. This is from Latin America. Well, I can tell you which one's gonna be Rob's favorite. Let me guess, the Inca Cola. Inca Cola. Ooh, Delaware Punch from Honduras. Let's try that. Whoops, spilled it again. Thank you. Dude, that's tea, peach from man mango. Mexico. Oh my gosh, that Delaware Punch is good. Really watery. Is it? Yeah. This is the Delaware Punch. Oh man, it's like a berry. Oh. I gotta get a new cup because mine's messy. And sanitize my hand because they're messy. I want to try this one from Mexico. I have assistance this time. Mm. It's kind of like a strawberry color. apple juice. What is it? Carbonated apple juice. Really? Let's try it. No, I want to try this one first. This one is uh, Ciel Aquarius from Mexico. Oh, it's good. It's weird. Very different. Just having some more peach and SC light. Whatever that is, it is unbelievably delicious and I can't describe it. It's from Paraguay. Mm. Oh my gosh, that's good. Isn't that good? Which one did you try? The Manzana Roja? Red apple. <laughs> Good. Can you finish that one? I don't want to drink all that. 
All right, I gotta try the Nesty Light from Brazil. Rob's giving me too much. <laughs> it's good stuff. Yeah. Did we try them all? Huh? We didn't try the ones from Asia, did we? No, we didn't. On May the 8th, Coca-Cola turns 125 years old. From Asia. Wish that guy would hush so you could hear me. This is going to have to be a whole video by itself because it's almost seven minutes long already. Why won't he shut up? Let's do our part. Go ahead. Go ahead. You might want to take a look at some of this kind of cool, interesting design. Of course, we made from coal. It's from China. It's called Smart Apple. It's green. Just drink it out of here and reuse it. Apple. Is it good? Try it. Have a good time. It's like green apple. It's really, really good. Have a great weekend. Oh, man, that's yummy. It's Jolly Rancher apple. Yeah. That's what it tastes like. It's delicious. Let's try this uh, Thirst Quencher Ice from Korea. It's just kind of like a light blue fizz color in there. You can't see it, sorry. Apple kiwi. Watermelon. Really? It's watermelon. Try this one. Which one is that? It's one from China. It's what? Smart? This one? <coughs> Smart watermelon flavor. I think there's not enough syrup in it. I think there's right out. Oh, that's good. But I like that, that one better than ice. It's just this light, refreshing, like almost blue raspberry flavor, but not syrupy. <laughs> Is it awful? Oh, the melon frosty? This one and this one. This one's good. Try this one. This is from Japan? Yeah. So this is not a soda, it's just a juice. It's like a juice, yeah. Oh my gosh, that's good. It's kind of sweet though. Mm -hmm. It is a little sweet. It's almost like an apple fruity yeah. something. You like that one? It's good, really good. Yeah. Did you try the melon frosty? Oh, it's a carbonation. It's oh. all carbonation. They're out of syrup. Oh. That was fun. <laughs> I'm going to go to the bathroom and do it again. <laughs> all right. I'll probably upload this one by itself, so I'll go ahead and say goodbye. And, uh... You guys should check out the world of Coke one of these days. And this is actually the exit, so we're done here for the day. Oh my, this has been a lot of fun. I hope I didn't just drink 10 points and tastes. <laughs> All right, have a good uh, day, night, evening, whatever it is, time that you're watching this. And thank you for watching. Bye. All right, we're going to check out the map. We just left the Coke factory over there. We're at Baker Street and Park Avenue West. That way, this way is Lucky Street. We're gonna go to Johnny Rockets. It's right there on the sign, right in front of the horsey horse. Oh, what a pretty horsey. Isn't that a pretty horse? Oh no, we're gonna get something to eat first. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. How much are the rides? No, it's 25 adult female couple books with me by around the city, but I give you guys $10 Okay, thank you. Thank you. That a beautiful horse. All right, here's where we're going. Up the street to Gianni Rockets. I hope they sing while we're in here. It's, it's been years since I've eaten at a Gianni Rockets, so we'll see what's going on. Yeah, I brought Chanel and Brianna here. But they didn't sing. They usually come out in the aisle and do a little routine the whole staff does. Alright, we're going in. I'll show you what I'm going to eat for lunch. Alright, we're on the inside of Johnny Rockets.
kitchen back there where they're uh, cooking. Child screaming bloody murder somewhere in here. It's a pretty small place. It is 2.31 and we're leaving downtown Atlanta. That dude's driving again, as usual. Um, we're gonna head back to the hotel and kind of freshen up because it's, uh, let's, let me show you what the temperature is. 94 degrees. When we got in the car, it said 98. And we're hot and sweaty. We just finished lunch at Johnny Rockets and uh, then we're gonna go hang out around the hotel and see what's over there. So I will, uh, check back in with you when we get there. Bye. Okay, we are out and about kind of wandering around near where our hotel is and we're gonna go into this market here because I am thinking this is an Asian market, like one that my sister took me to in where she lives. And if it is, I'm really, really stinking excited. You guys have no idea what a dork I am and how much I love Asian markets. <laughs> But everything in this complex, that bank over there, sorry, that bank over there and everything down that row and then down this row over here um, is Asian stuff. So I just found my, uh, my heaven. And most of it is Japanese stuff. Pretty excited. So, yeah, we're gonna go in this store here and I'll probably turn the camera back on and show you what's going on. Wow. <laughs> and I'm tired, so I'm like talking slowly and I don't really know what to say, so bear with me. I don't, I don't really know why I'm tired because we slept fine last night and the bed in the hotel is like, I want to take it home with me. It's only $1,700. <laughs> it's only $1,700. <laughs> so, all right, we'll be back. out of the way. Uh, either way, I mean, one. 
one cabin. What is that? Uh, lavish. Pico lavish. Oh, that's good. Yeah. Now it's a more Is this tofu? Right? tofu? No, not tofu. Fish cake. Fish cake. Oh, thank you. Hey. Look at that. Hey. Rob is a natural. She's making her own Looks good, honey. Sushi? Oh. It's Korean sushi. Korean sushi. Actually, it's Puerto Rican Korean sushi now. <laughs> 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 Alright, that would be good. I can't lose. Right. <laughs> can't lose now. That is really good. Trippies? Oh, I thought that was yours to take home. Try a bite. Okay. We don't need to eat all that. <laughs> you did good, honey. <laughs> We're still in the Asian market because look all the way down there. And on the other side of that rounder right there is another wall that is way down there. This place is ginormous. I'm a little overwhelmed. I want one of everything. All right. I'll be back. All right, this is the uh, first part of my dinner. It is salad with ginger dressing, miso, a little bit of seaweed salad, and some bean sprouts marinated in um, different things. All right, I'll be back with my main course.